next conservation of momentum first i will tell about the what is the conservation so conservation means we cannot create the energy what is the conservation law we will discuss first what is the conservation law means we cannot create the energy we cannot destroy the energy simply energy changing from one form to another form then we can say that is the law of conservation okay what is conservate conservating here momentum okay what is the formula momentum p is equal to mv so now i am going to prove it how the momentum is conservating so i said about already momentum what is the formula momentum is equal to mv mv so now i am going to derive about this formula so can i uh, conservation of momentum if there is no external force if there is no external force uh, on the particle or on the body so then the total momentum of the particle will be constant so if there is no then what you can write here tell me f is equal to can i write dp by dt all of you agree yes okay what is the conservation of momentum if there is no external force on the body then what i mean the conservation momentum on the particle if there is no force acting on the body or particle if there is no force acting on the body or then the total momentum of the then the total momentum of the the total momentum of the interacting particle particle is constant constant so if there is no force acting on the body or particle then the total momentum of interacting particle is constant okay now i am going to prove it simply so what is the formula if there is no external force then what we can write f is equal to then what we can write dp by dt okay if uh, here f is equal to how much there is no force then f is equal to zero then what we can write dp by dt is equal to zero then what happen the if it is come this side zero into dt is equal to dp then G, dp is equal to how much zero if you take integration what happen then p is equal to constant so ends proved ends proved okay conservation the momentum is conserved so what we can say the conservation of momentum means if you are able to prove p is equal to constant means that will be finished